Classic TV fans, Rick Nige here. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to be talking about the hit show, Emergency. I want to continue giving Emergency props for the 50th anniversary. In 2022, the show is 50 years old. That's an amazing accomplishment, and I'm celebrating it by making a lot of Emergency videos with facts, bloopers, a lot of cool and interesting things, secret cameos, and things that you will absolutely love. So don't forget to check the link in the description below for more emergency videos. Now I know a lot of you are really excited to find out about this really amazing cameo. I know that a lot of you are fans of her, so if you want to watch it yourself, I'll tell you the episode and give you all the information right now. It comes from season four, it's episode three. The episode's called The Gossip. Now it aired September 28th, 1974. As you know, all of these emergencies that take place on the show are real, but they are recreated with the actors that we see on screen. But these are real stories, they're not made up. And in this one we have several ones. One where Roy and John have to break into an armored car that's involved in an accident in order to rescue a trapped passenger. Now the victim himself was driving the car that hit it. He got a skull fracture that needed consent from his wife. Now, Dixie discusses this, but it turns out that the man has not one, but two wives. I'll get back to this because our super guest star is the one who is one of these wives. Now, one of these Rampart nurses starts to spread rumors about D Dr. Morton's financial situation, and Dixie also confronts a young, experienced nurse about spreading gossip. Now there's also a story about a child who's brought in with cyanide poisoning from eating peach pits, which is pretty funny, and Roy tries to get John to enter the fireman's Olympic track events. Now the firemen rescue a man hanging in midair from live power lines, electrocution victims hanging in midair, and a trapped man in an explosive warehouse fire. That's a lot of emergencies happening in one. But the one I wanna focus on specifically is with Dixie, Nurse Dixie. Now she has the one, she has the responsibility who has to tell the wife, hey, you gotta sign for your husband. We have, he needs treatment, you're the next of kin. But then they find out, well the women find out, they meet each other and they find out that they are both wives of the same man and they never knew this. Of course, it was a shock to them. Remember, this was a true story. Again, these are not the actual women. In fact, one of them you may recognize from a show from the 60s, so about a decade before. That is Batman. Yes, Batman, the 1960s television show with Adam West, Burt Ward, and later on in season three, Batgirl. Now, who was Batgirl played by? Of course, Yvonne Craig, and this is her, this is Yvonne Craig's appearance on Emergency. It was the only time she appeared on Emergency, and it's really cool to have her here because a lot of you are fans of Batman and Emergency as well. I mean, I'm gonna continue making these videos because it's so interesting to see them, to see these actors that were maybe stars or main stars on other shows, come on other shows and do little guest appearances, little cameos, little just, appearances that we're so surprised to see. I mean, I know a lot of you didn't even know that John Travolta was in Emergency. Yep, I covered that in a video. So I won't reveal it all in this one, but make sure to check out my Emergency playlist so you can see a lot more videos just like this. Now, my question to all of you is, have you seen this episode? Did you see it yourself? Did you enjoy it? And did you catch that it was Yvonne Craig? Now, this is, again, 10 years after Batman aired. She looks pretty much the same, which is amazing. A lot of the actors who do appear in shows from the 60s look a lot different in their 70s, or that is in the 1970s. And 10 years goes by and Yvonne Craig looks amazing as ever. What are your thoughts on this episode? Have you seen it? And will you want to go and rewatch it now that you know that it is Yvonne Craig, Batgirl? We'll see you all next time. Thank you so much for supporting the channel and most importantly, be hopeful. Thank you so much to everyone who supports my work on Patreon. David D, Sally N, Gerard D, Greg S, Ricky, Citizen Kane 359, Kevin K, and Vito L. If you want to appear on this list, don't forget to look at the Patreon description in the link below. Thank you.